So you wanna trade the largest moving stocks in the stock market. All in this one video, I'm gonna show you guys how to create a scanner to find these stocks. And I'm also gonna go over my automated trading strategy for how I trade these stocks. So make sure you hit like and subscribe and let's dive right in. Wasting no time, let's jump right into the scanner. Now, I already have a couple of default parameters set that I set in all my scanners. I only want to see stocks that are above a dollar, and I set some minimums in here for market cap and volume, just so that the scanners don't return me in a or insanely low market cap or volume stocks. So those are already existing, but the meat and bones of this scan and the meat and bones of how you're going to find strong stocks to trade is this. I'm going to add a study filter and I'm going to go to custom. I'm going to go to my think script editor and I'm going to call percent change and I'm going to look if it's over 50. Uh, if the percent change is over 50, return those stocks. We'll go over these charts in just a second. But before we do, let's talk about the percent change study a little bit. This is a study. This is a study you can add to your chart out of the box on Thinkorswim. Uh, that's why I was able to call it so easily. And obviously, let's not insult your intelligence too much. It's going to show you the percent change. But specifically, if we click into the parameters, it's going to show you the percent change over the last 14 bars depending on the closing price of the stock on each day. Obviously, these parameters can be changed, but those are the default settings. So over the last 14 days, the difference in the closing price, the average of the difference in the closing price is what is returned in this scan. If we jump back into the scan now, I also have a custom coded column uh, in here that shows you the number of consecutive days that this stock has been above the 50% change line, right? I trade live over on Twitch TV every day. See you there. Let's save this scan query as um, big movers video. Uh, I want to save this scan query so that I can do this right here, a fun little thing. I can now load Big Movers video, and as I click through these stocks, if I give it a second to load in, uh, as I click through these stocks, they will appear on my screen. But you will notice, look at a lot of the names on here. You will recognize a lot of the names on here, but a lot of the names you won't recognize. Uh, KLR, I've, I've not seen anybody talking about this stock. And look, it's gone from 160 to 480 in the last month and a half. Uh, AAOI, you've probably, you've maybe heard of people talking about this one, but still from 170 to above five in about that same time period. And as I just click through the daily charts of some of these, a lot of them are just gappers. Uh, we do ignore gappers. I'll get into that a little bit with the strategy, but, uh, just here's a, here's a bad gapper. As we continue to click through, you will see a lot of just big multi-day runners that come from just a simple little percent change scan, right? Look at EOSC, this huge runner. And a lot of them you don't even see talked about. That's the that's the parameter you're going to enter into your scanner to see these multi-day runners. Before I jump into the synopsis of the strategy, let me show you the real results. I started trading this strategy on May 30th. So it's been just about a month now, a couple of days short of a month. And on just $5,000 positions, I'm up $2,400. That's pretty dang good of 50% of your position sizes that you're taking. Of course, we do enter multiple stocks a day, but still $5,000 positions in the first month of trading a strategy while I'm even still working out a little bit of the kinks. We're up $2,400. If I click into the detailed, it does have a 42% win rate, but the average winner is 272. The average loser is 154. Got a profit factor of 1.3. Those are all pretty darn good real world statistics. Let's jump into the actual strategy synopsis now. Now, I'm about to jump into my strategy, but first I wanna to touch on this consecutives, uh, consecutive days above kind of custom column I have here. That, along with the strategy I'm about to go over you with, with you, is made available to tier three subs in my Discord. 
Links in the top of the description. You will get access to the uh, trading strategy that I use. You will get access to my custom strategy, my custom scanner, and the custom columns within my scanner of this strategy, all my other strategies, and any strategy I will make in the future for just $25 a month. So eat one more packed lunch this month and buy yourself some stock strategies instead. All right, shilling over, I promise. I get, I get one quick shill a video, okay? Um, Anyway, let's jump into the strategy. So my strategy is a day trading strategy. If I load it, it is called trading runners. And if I go into the, it is a five minute strategy. So if we go into the five minute chart, let's also turn on floating p &L so that you all can see how the strategy is performing. Uh, but you will notice, let me, let, let me give a quick synopsis of what the strategy is trying to do. The strategy is of course scanning for strong multi-day gainers. Uh, it's looking for stocks that have been very strong across the large consecutive numbers of days, according to the percent change indicator. And then it is looking for continuation intraday on these stocks. Psychologically, why? These stocks are just huge on the daily bullish movers. They've got nothing but bullish tailwinds behind them. Statistically, of course, not always. No strategy always wins anything like that. But statistically, it's easier for these stocks to continue up, right? Trends your friend. Trends more likely to continue than it is to fail. You guys have heard all the, all the buzzwords, all the sentences, but do it. That's kind of what this strategy does. It looks for these really strong stocks. And then on the five minute chart, it looks to get in. It gets in at an early sign of strength, which once again, I'm not gonna dive into the exacts with you guys. You can pay for that. But the, the, the easy synopsis is it buys in on an early sign of strength. And the goal, the end goal is that it holds all day. This was today on Carvana, by the way. Very nice. And you can see on just $5,000 positions, my strategy is up $3,700 on Carvana. Very nice. But the goal, yes, is to hold all day. Let the trend ride all day. You are buying into huge moving stocks. Let that trend pay you. And then when you're wrong, get stopped out quickly. You know, once again, you're going to be wrong. It's not just going to go, oh, well, it's on the scanner, so it's going to go up. No, of course, you're going to be wrong relatively often. But you get out quickly when you are, once again, from a very measured stop loss. But you let the winners run really, really big. I wonder, I need to find an example of, because it doesn't always hold until end of day uh, for profit. Is there a good example of a take profit before end of day here it also will get stopped out this strategy doesn't wait for it to go all the way back red this isn't maybe a great example because carbonic kind of dumps pretty hard but you also can get stopped out early if you notice a sort of momentum shift intraday which once again is backed by a very specific reason that I'm not going to give away for free for you all. But um, if we just click through a couple here, Carvana is crushing. Uh, AAOI has actually only taken one trade, but it crushed that trade very well. Um, what else have I been trading lately? I traded AI a lot. Um, I traded AI for a long time uh, and did very well on this. You can see the strategy is up $3,900. Uh, if we go to the daily chart on AAOI quickly, this of course was, it is no longer on the scanner anymore, of course, because now it's rolling over really hard. Look at the percent change indicator now negative, but it was on the scanner for a long time back here. And I was able to capitalize on this name pretty well if uh i could just scroll if thinkorswim stops freaking out i mean look at some of the women I mean, look at the wins you're able to capture with this sort of strategy just find the big stocks enter when strength is proven ride that trend get stopped out small when you're wrong but man you can really really make some really good money with this strategy i have made some really good money with this strategy I stream this strategy over on Twitch every single day. So if you want to see it working live, that link is also in the description down below. Of course, that's completely free, a free trade room over there. You guys can watch me trade live, but that is the general idea of this video. I showed you guys how to scan for large moving stocks. And then I gave you guys at least, at least my short synopsis of what my strategy is looking to do. Those of you guys that do decide to buy the code, thank you for your support. And I hope you find ways that you can implement it into your trading strategy. With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and sign out of this video. I will catch you all in the next one.